Scott, let's talk about this weekend. Uh, you didn't even close out a game, and you guys still get the sweep. I mean, talk about what that was like for you. Uh, that was that was a huge weekend this weekend. I mean, Michigan State, <laughs> everyone said that they're going to be in it at the end. That's a good team, and to get a sweep over over that kind of team, that caliber team, uh, the way we pitched, I uh, got clutch hitting. Uh, and in, and if, even if I didn't pitch as much as I usually do, and being able to save my arm, that's that's huge moving forward. Were you guys happy with you know just how this home stand's going as of late? Yeah, yeah. I mean, you can't you can't really be disappointed with how we've been playing. Uh, could have could have closed out Morehead State on that Sunday, but you know games like that happen. But I I'd, I'd say we've been pretty happy with the way we've been playing as of late. Just what do you think this entire weekend said for the staff as a whole? You know, between the bullpen and the starters to be able to you know just after all the injuries you've had, kind of reshuffle and you know kind of formula to do as well as you did. Yeah, I mean, whatever whatever streak we're on, like one run in however many innings to to be able to do that over over quality teams, uh, that's that's unbelievable. Uh, we've been we've been throwing pretty well um, from top to bottom, getting great starts from our great starts from our starters. Joey going out there and doing what he does, uh, and Cordy coming in. And, you know, filling the spot, uh, and Luke Harrison being outstanding. Um, so I, it's really, it's really been impressive. I think. What's it meant, I guess, to get that? I mean, knowing what you guys have had to replace, the way you guys have had to adjust twice now with injuries, just kind of what has it meant to see guys continue to just kind of change their roles in the middle of the season and, and step up like that? Yeah, um, I mean, losing Ryan and uh, Kyle Hart is obviously, you know, tough as a pitching staff. Two, two of the better pitchers we've had. Uh, here in at least my career, um, but I mean, it's I've said it before. It's like staff effort that everyone has to pick up um, where they left off, I guess. Uh, and we've had definitely, I think we've had um, bullpen and starters uh, pick up for how they were pitching before they got hurt. I guess how does the bullpen operate differently as a whole compared to you know not having a closer, you know, a straight ninth inning guy like you had with Halstead? Um, you know, some other guys are picking up more innings. Basically, how do you how does just the entire system operate differently uh, just with the personnel changes you had? Well, I wouldn't say it's differently. I think um, I think when we had Ryan, uh, we still had um, the pressure for everyone needs to pitch well when their number's called upon, and uh, that happened. But, I mean, losing Ryan, like I said, obviously hurts. But I, I, don't, I wouldn't say it operates differently. Um, we all need to – we all just basically need to be ready whenever our number's called. Uh, I mean, we have, uh, we have the capability to do it. Um, it's just kind of a mindset thing, I guess. What's allowed certain guys to be able to kind of extend when, when it's come to innings, I guess? I mean, there's certain, you know, certainly Brian Cordy was a guy who would often come in to face one guy. You know, now he's now he's a starter. You know, Luke Harrison is, you know, having more innings. You obviously can take three, four, or five mm-hmm. in it if a game if need be. You know, what do you guys do as a staff to make sure you're capable of that, that you can go from, you know, kind of a one-inning, two-inning guy to three, four, five if need be? Uh, I mean, it starts, I mean, it starts all the way back in the fall, like conditioning our arms to, you know, go however many innings uh, Skip needs to go. Um, Brian Cordy and Luke Harrison are great pitchers, uh, and just, it's just a credit to how they how they work every day. Um, but uh, I mean, I guess it's like like I said, like everybody needs to have the mentality of whenever the number's called, going out there and doing their role um, and fulfilling. And I think we've done a great job of that. I mean, Cordy Cordy having two starts in last week, however many innings he threw, and doing as well as he did is is awesome. Uh, you know, Luke can come in, in any situation and pitch well, and we have every every other guy that can. Pretty much come in in every situation to do well. So I think that's I think that's pretty good when we have that role. At Ohio State at Iowa, you know, you guys like really dominated those series. Uh, this week is a little different. You guys had to grind out those wins. Just talk about how different that was for you guys. Uh, I mean, like I said, Michigan State's a really good team. Uh, we're not. We never expected to roll through the Big Ten play um, like we had against Ohio State and Iowa. We knew we'd face like good competition, and, I, and Iowa and Ohio State are good. But I mean, just. It's just a testament to uh, earlier on in our season uh, playing those close games on the road, uh, traveling and far uh, far away to you know play good competition, and now it's really paying off to see that uh, see that we can when there is a close game, extra inning game, we can get it done. Do you like coming out of the bullpen behind Luke Harrison? Yeah, I I, I really don't care when I throw. Uh, Luke's Luke's awesome to watch pitch. I mean, he just gets strikeout after strikeout, uh, and he you know he's an energy guy like me. He gets pumped up. Uh, but I mean, if I'm before him or after him, you know, it really, it really doesn't matter uh, when I'm throwing. I guess, what does that do for you? You know, pitching on the mound there when he's pounding strikes, something like that. What does that do for you when you come in? Yeah, I mean, I'd, I'd say me and Luke are a lot uh, pretty similar as far as throwing strikes. Um, that's our, that's our big thing. You know, we we want to go in there uh, and and control the strike zone. And I think that Luke this weekend definitely did that, and the entire season, everybody's been doing that. 
Um, but I mean, when when me and him are throwing when throwing well, and the rest of our bullpen's contributing, I think it's I think it's uh, going to be pretty hard to uh, score runs off us at the end of the games.